we meet again. She was playing Decay and... Uh, and... Energy when I was last playing against her, so I wonder which one will it be now. Uh, I, I will keep the Lockling Brood in case it's something like... If it's growth, Lockling Brood is great. <laughs> 15 new low-quality viewers. Yes! The low-quality viewers! Welcome to the stream, low-quality viewers. Now increase your goddamn quality. Six, fifty-five, one. Finish my turn. You never stop punching axe. I did! Now I'm whipping elders. It's decay. Six, fifty-five, one. Six, three, three. That smuggler is probably gonna get uh, soul steeled. I'm hoping he, he's gonna poison him instead, so that he's not gonna have any spell against the Lockling Brood. 3 1. Finish my turn. It seems like a very reasonable thing to bait out any removal, and then maybe Lockling will be safer. Six four one one. Now, I don't need the shrine. 6, 3, 2. And I may need the whip on the Storm Runner. 3, 2. 3, 2. Finish my turn. Let's see if that's Soul Steel or Poison. Please, no Soul Steel. Soul Steel would be brutal as hell. It's a Soul Steel, fuck you. 3, 2. 4, 2. Six three three one. Six two one. Two two. Finish my turn. Let's see if I can lock down the board with this brood, or will he have poison still? That would be pretty unfortunate. Or she? I'm not sure really. Blinky! Oh fuck! He's got poison. And he did get the card draw for that, so that was the most efficient thing he could possibly do. Or two. What is the... okay. 4-1. Oh. 6-2-1-1. One. One. Six, one, one. One, one. Three, two. Finish my turn. Welcome, Blinky! How do you like my Gravelocks? I think it may be the deck of this metagame. Even after the nerf. 4-1. 3-1. Three, two, um, six, one, one, um, six, one, one, two. Why do you cry about brain lies? It's perfectly balanced and completely fun to play with and against. Six, two, one. Six, two, one. Six, twenty, one. Three, three. Three, two. Two, two. Actually... Yeah, alright. Oh, I can't move him. Oh. Finish my turn. I guess. Wait, what? Brain Lies just became balanced? What happened to Brain Lies? I didn't read the patch notes, god damn it! What what is the brain lies? So this is a pretty cool thing because I'm gonna kill this guy and then the storm runner will instantly kill the uh, the the husk. Six two one one. Three three, ability. Three three, ability. Finish my turn, and I kind of do like the forge in this matchup, is, even though it's grave locks. Have, having the ability to pump is just economically really good sometimes. I like it. Brain lies costs more. Now it costs four. Really? Really?
Now, I theoretically could just move forward, use Fury. Nah, I can't. No, actually, I could burn, sacrifice for resources, and then use Fury. And then he would have a husk that I can kill. But then I'm gonna deal only 3 damage to the Doctor, regardless. Because the... The Stormrunner has no way of really doing it. Unless the Stormrunner goes first... Yes! Yes! I can do it. Oh. 2, 5. 6, 2, 2, 1. 6, 1, 1. Oh. Finish my turn. I did it! I actually did it! And Fluffy just leveled up. Congratulations, Fluffy. Oh, awesome. Click middle. Alright, balance update change log. Oh. Ancestral pack now counts down. Snorgel omelette is cheaper. Oh, wow. He just damned my elder. So he, oh, wow. He is still very much in this game. And he's got seven cards. Oh yeah, I haven't won yet. No kidding. S Snorgle Omelette could be more viable now. I may actually want to re-include it. Freak is more expensive. Nice nerf. It was needed. Grave locks were way too OP. Wing Spear increases Spiky by three. Was two when Dominion is active. Hmm, okay. And Brain Lights costs four. And Banner of Ordinance doesn't crash anymore, so I could use it with Order to remove lingering spells more reliably. 6112. Very sexy fool. That is such a word, man. That is such a word. Wait, what? Why are you face bombing, Anti Rad? Omelette got nerfed, not buffed? Oh, the ability costs 3? I thought the... Wait, what? Oh, it's HP got... Oh, it's HP. I thought it was the cost. I thought it obviously needed an, a buff because it wasn't that good. And they nerfed it instead of buffing it. Oh. Shit. Okay. So now I'm definitely not gonna use that omelette. Never mind. Oh, fuck. The omelette wasn't as good. Not really. Uh, maybe I don't have enough experience in the matter, but what I can say from personal experience is that I played two mirrors, Gravelock versus Gravelock. Both times my opponents used the omelette and lost, probably because of it. Because it was too slow paced and Gravelocks. Gravelocks aren't supposed to be played economically, they're supposed to be played like a tempo deck that builds up a lot of creatures on the board that, that synergize with each other. And that omelette was just too slow and economical instead of just Gravelock focused. It wasn't focusing on just building up the Gravelock on the board. So yeah, in my opinion, the omelette wasn't that good. And it, I did expect a buff rather than the nerf. Six, two, two, two. So now he's just playing control with seven cards in his hand and just slowly poisoning me to death. Six, twenty-two, two. Three, two. One, two, three. Two, two. Three, two. Two, three. Oh. Three, three. Ability. Three, three. Ability. Six, three, two. Three, one. Oh. 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 Three, one. Two, one. In case he plays the Mire Curse. Finish my turn. 
I don't want to surround the middle creature with everyone. And um, I don't want to commit too much to the board. So that forge is now a godsend. I can build up my hand of cards and just pump the forge every turn. And those potatoes can take the lights, no problem. A taint as well, ouch, okay. I guess they can't take it. Damn. All right. Six, three, two, two. Now, do I even want to play the Elder or... Six, four, two. Four, two. Three, three. Ability. Three, three. Ability. I'm gonna play Elder as a surprise that increases my damage instantly. Finish my turn. Let's just keep cranking out the potatoes. Maybe they will absorb the... the light damage. Welcome back the quality button! Yay! Yay! The stream cut off, it, it, just, it had a micro restart as the quality options got added. And now he commits back to the board with a Witch Hunter. Alright. I could do Whip Machinated on my Gravelock, which would bring him up to... A 7 damage, it's enough. Let's do it. It'll cost me 4. So I can... Cr I can crank the Forge once, I can't play the, the Elder, no matter what. 6, 4, 2, 2. 6, 53. 4, 2. 6, 4, 1. 4, 2. Come. 5, 2. And it's a very good thing to be able to kill an... A Witch Doctor. 3, 2. 4, 3. 3, 3. Ability. 2-1. Finish my turn. Alright. I'm pretty okay with what happened here. Although she still has a card and resource advantage. And my board is made up of small and poisoned units. So I don't really feel like I'm winning. I need to keep his board clear. I need him to not be able to set up those things, like, oh god, okay. That's another Machinated, I have to keep doing that. The Lockling Brood is probably not gonna be useful considering how many spells he actually has. Six, four, three... Six, four, three, one. Four, three. Five, two. Six three two five two six two two four three and I probably want this freak so that when my grave lock takes damage from the poison he gets triggered finish my turn I can't pump this turn to in the forge so I might as well do this Failed username? It probably should. It is a spell, so it should deal spell damage, right? So theoretically, it would make perfect sense that it does. In practice, you'd have to just test, but I, I would say that yeah. Okay, I can't have more Machinated in my deck, pretty much. 6222. 6222. So this doctor will survive. I can't do anything about it. 3-3. Three, three. Ability. Oh. 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 4 3. three two. Oh. Oh. He's got two blights on him. Damn it! 6 3 1. 3 1. These blights are eating me alive. Finish my turn. Finish my turn. But I don't have time to remove them ever. This is not looking good. 
This is not looking good. I think he's got his comeback. Yeah, he does have his comeback. My freak now dies, and those plagues will spread. Ah, oh, wow. My 7-2 also is about to die pretty soon. 6, 3, 2, 2. Man, if I could whip this guy and still make him attack, but no. I guess I can whip the Elder. 3, 1. 2, 1. So one thing he is lacking right now is he didn't protect his Doctor. Is this some kind of weird decay deck, actually, with just Doctors, Harvesters, and... And uh, removal spells, or is he just playing this way? 6, 4, 4. 2, 1. Six, three, one. Four, two. Three, one. Three, two. Four, two. Whip the freak to get rid of the blight, but then I wouldn't kill the doctor. And it's not about derping. It's probably a very important thing to. To get rid of the doctor. It would be nice though, two plagues. But the doctor has to die. <laughs> Who was handling the... Wait, a cap? Shouldn't it be a baseball bat? I don't know. But I would really like to have Fury right now. 6, 22, 2. Fury! Oh, Burn doesn't quite do it, but Machinated, no. Still, shit. Shit. I guess I could Burn and then see what I can top deck. Oh no, Burn Machinated does it, because then he's exposed. Okay, nice. Again, I could burn my own guy to get rid of the blights, but screw that. I'm killing this harvester. Three, two. Six, two, two. Finish my turn. Uh, so I am managing to wipe him again, and I am slowly trickling some damage into his idols. Wow, that was a really good miss. Everyone was about to attack. Holy balls. Nicely done there. Nicely done. I'm definitely gonna disperse this. Yeah. Six three three one. Six twenty two. Three six. Three three. Ability. Four two. Three one. Finish my turn. Ah <sighs> man, this this removal. She still has eight cards. I'm really not handling this. I'm really... I think I'm losing. Another Bloodline Taint. A lot of my guys are just gonna die now. 6, 2, 2, 2. Ah, I was hoping for Fury. I really was. But now, if he kills this... this Forge, actually... I am losing so much of my economy because of that. But I guess he has only 4 damage, doesn't he? 3, 3. 3, 3. Ability. 3, 3. I think I want this potato. Ability. 
Six, three, three. Four, two. I do want this potato. Finish my turn. Especially since it could be the last one for my forge. If he just finds a way to... Oh, come on! Another mist! Man, everything can't move again! My units were so damn synchronized, it really bites me in the ass right now. Wow, that is the... most controlling... Oh, the most controlling decay I've played in a long while. I'm gonna need this dispersal again in case of more harvesters. Six, three, two, two. Oh, now I get my fury. All right. Now I get it. I guess I'm gonna take it. I'll take it whenever I can. Although no, I should use it next turn. Actually, I should just. No, because next turn he will place something in front of this guy. Oh wow, he has three blights actually. But still, is it worth dispersing? Hell, if it is, I I think it is, guys. I'm dispersing this shit. Finish my turn. No more blights on the field, I get to kill my first idol and wipe the board. And now I have no great blocks on the field pretty much because that guard is poisoned. So I'm in trouble, a lot of my board just went down, most of it actually. Oh man. Now I could kill this tribesman. But I think I'd rather draw a card with my smuggler. Oh, now he dumps everything on the field. Now that I am weakened. 6, 3, 3. 3, 5. That is obvious. And then Luckling Brood is kind of a risky thing. 6, 3, 2, 2. 4, 2. 5, 2. I want another Forge. 3, 2. 3, 3. 2, 2. 3, 2. If I play the Elder now, my uh, guard will survive to actually attack. 4, 1. 6, 4, 1. 2, 2. So that's something I really want to have. And he doesn't have a spell that will make those units attack, so it's okay that my, gar that my Gravelock Elder is exposed like this. Unless he plays Necro, I guess. 3, 3. 2, 3. Yeah, if he plays Necro, then I shouldn't expose myself like this. Finish my turn. Necro would be bad. Halt of Umlasa. Oh, I, I sacked my enigmas. Okay, he's gonna have even more economy. God damn it. Too much! I can't handle it! And it's just three damage on my side. I got the forge. That's nice. Six, fifty-one, two. If that Lockling Brood isn't gonna work, he's got too many cards to not have a spell, let's be honest. If he had the... the uh, wait, if he plays... Oh. Oh. 
If he curses, the Lockling Brood, does the Lockling Brood just die? Guys? Okay, I have no time. So I gotta do kind of the intuitive thing. Oh crap, the bug. Ah, I, I thought about it for too long, about the Lockling Brood possibility. I thought about it too long, and it really didn't serve me properly. Oh, wow. So he prefers to just murder my smuggler with poison. And then place a harvester there. It's good. I, since he spends his poison right now, I think I'm gonna be okay with playing the brood next turn. See how that works out for me. Paint on the grave locks. Yeah, it's probably smart. My guard will die, so uh, the freak will trigger. If it curses with a spell, with a scroll, but not with the... Okay. And the Baleful Witch triggers the curse. Okay. First one. Two, two. Alright, I would really like uh, Machination Mindset, but probably not gonna happen. I think he doesn't have poison, so I can play the Lockling Brood right now. And Uhu. And then Potion of Resistance in the middle. I guess I don't need the potion yet. Um. Um. Dispersal could work too. Very nicely. Because three units are dying here, actually. I need to disperse this. Um. I have to. And then forge or guard. Oh. I'm gonna go with the guard. Oh. Finish my turn. Okay. Okay. I want the guard to start counting down and deal some damage. The forge is there for me to pump if I have too many resources and not enough cards, but I have a lot of cards right now. I'll be I'll I'll spend all my energy for the next two turns at least with burn lockling and long nose. And the potion of resistance kind of counters the harvester by itself, so I may not need to worry too much. It would be nice if I could uh, kill this curse monger. Somehow. Six, 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 two. Let's see if I can get a whip. That would be amazing. Nope. Damn it. Okay. I could burn my own unit, and that would kill him. That would kill the curse monger. But no, I'd have to burn my elder. <laughs> Fuck that. Fuck that. He's just gonna move, and that's it. So this is what I'm gonna do. He cannot kill my freak. He can, if he wants, to damage my forge, and uh, he still has Lockling Brute to deal with. And this is not AI war music now. Right now, it's Bionic Dews music, which is from the same developer, I believe, as AI war. Bionic Dews. Probably for, I think it is from the same developer. Oh, a Bloodline Taint! He nails it! Holy shit, that was good. That was such a good spell to cast on the Lockling Brood. Because it affects every war every grave lock on the field. But then if, is the witch the yes, the potion protects me from the witch like I thought. Now I can burn the witch. But then I can deal only three damage to the harvester. 
because I don't have the Elder anymore. Never mind, the Draining Mist fixes it. Shit, well played. I really thought I was in a good position. And then this happens. Wow. Wow, the Baleful Witch Decay. 655 too. Whip and burn kills the harvester. Let's do it. Four three. Um, six six six. Or with the machination and machin machinated and whip, I could kill the witch doctor. I think it's more important, to be honest. But I can do that next turn. No, in two turns. Nah, I can't do it. Shit, do I kill the Harvester or the Witch Doctor? I will keep the Machination Mindset and the Machinated in my hand, so I will have a chance to kill that Witch Doctor again with the same combo. Home. 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 But for now, this is the priority. He's all- he is- he would just count down next turn and trigger. It's unacceptable. Maybe I shouldn't shouldn't have exposed this guy. Maybe I should have risked the new one, even though he wasn't cursed and one HP, because the new one has two count. I guess no, this one has two countdown as well because of the mist. Never mind. Finish my turn. It's good. It's good. Finish my turn. It's all good. This is a pretty complicated game over here. I'd really like to keep my forge actually, because I will run out of scrolls. I will need to pump in order to keep my economy okay. But she has 7 scrolls and 10 DK. I just can't deal with the economy of the Umlasa. Yes, Freak now costs 6, there was a patch. Wait, what? How did my guy die? Oh, Soul Steel. That was a Soul Steel. Shit, well played. I should have kept the new guard in here. Um, Enigma really helps. And now I could do... No, uh, come on, I'm missing one decay. For the combo. Oh, but maybe it's gonna be okay because of the whip. If, because whip triggers both of them. No, it's still not gonna kill the doctor. Yeah... But whip machinated machination. I cannot do machinated machination. Ah, oh. just barely not enough. Just freaking barely. Home. 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 Finish my turn. Damn it! Next time. Home. 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 Finish my turn. Next time, I'm getting him. I will get that doctor. My po my potion still protects me for one more turn, so if he hits me, it's just one HP. Maybe he'll even forget and just deal the damage. Ah. <sighs> that stone enigma was really nice, but she still has six scrolls on 10 decay. She still has... Uh, she, she's still ahead of me in economy. Decides to probably curse my Uhu. Or curse the Forge. I would expect. And I will kill this Doctor. Unless he places something like a Tribesman in the front. And I will just not have enough damage. You could have sniped an Idol? I don't care about sniping an Idol. Because if I kill his idol, he will only have an easier easier time protecting his other three idols. And then I will... As soon as I lose the board control, I lose the game. This is how it works right now. So Machination Machinated here, for sure. 
and then I will still afford the Freak. But if I whip this guy, I will take no damage. And then I will have four mana left. But the Enigma is just not a good choice here. I want something else. Like a Storm Runner, okay. Um. 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 If he triggers the Harvester right now... Um. Um. I am gonna be okay with it. It's just gonna hit the a 10 HP idol. He can kill my one guard. It's not a tragedy or anything. Um. Um. Finish my turn. Although he will kill a unit that was buffed, and that is a little unfortunate, but... Uh, let's see if he even can. It's still on one countdown. Cash flow getting lessons from Joyful Road. <laughs> there it is. Only here on Joyful Road stream. Teaching the pros how to be pro. Brain lies. That still doesn't trigger the harvester. It it will next turn because this guy has curse. Yeah, never mind. Okay. Shit. I I need something here. Or I'm just gonna get my middle fucked and um, that is actually not acceptable um, I think I lost I think I lost the fury isn't enough fury is just not enough yeah I'm losing my forge the fury can kill this guy and clear my middle so yeah I, it's okay it's kind of okay um. Um. Because he has a choice between killing my 8-3 or killing my Forge. Actually, no! Lockling Brood Fury! No, it's not enough. But I'm gonna still do it. Um. I love that combo. And there's no reason not to pump. Finish my turn. It wipes most of his things. He's not gonna benefit from the Fury too much, because he just has that husk alive and the Harvester. Okay. No, Fury isn't minus two, it's minus one. So that 8-3... Cannot really... Oh, okay. And then poison on my 8-3, and he cannot kill the idol anymore. And then he clears the middle and kills my... Oh, yeah, oh, he wins. Okay, GG. This is his game now. I couldn't do it. Well played. Well played, Eva. Really well played. Wow. It was some impressive control play. I mean, I didn't expect the K to be... So, control-oriented with the Baleful Witch and the Bloodline Taint. Didn't see that one coming. 6, 3, 2, 2. 6, 4, 1. 3, 2. 6, 3, 3. Um. 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 Finish my turn. <sighs> Someone told you Irva is bad. <laughs> if you play no decay units, yeah. It's bad. Playing the shrine was a mistake. But yeah, Snargo Omelette, I'm not convinced by it, honestly. But maybe I was just doing it wrong. But it's, the thing is, my opponents played it and they lost, but maybe they were doing it wrong. Maybe it's just a case of just being able to use it properly. And I think I made a mistake not keeping this guy in front of the Gravelock. Although, no, it's okay, because I, I was scared that he would uh, block the Harvester with with the Meat Shield, but it seems that... I, th I guess he will move the Harvester to one of these spots, and the Harvester will not die now.
Yep. Oblivion Seeker as well. Six, three, one, two. Oh wow, Brood Fury again. Oh wow, this lines up perfectly actually. Um. 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 Two, two. Um. Um. Finish my turn. I kill everyone except, except for Irva. Am I still in this? I think I'm still in this. But Eva again has 10 cards. She has the Halls of Umlasa in her hand. So economically, I am not in this. I'm not. If I keep trading, I will eventually lose through, through just economical disadvantage. I had to sack my Fury in order to pull this off, so I'm not gonna draw a Fury and attack right now. She's gonna set up too much on the board. Yeah, I, I still lose, I still lose. It was a nice beginning of a comeback, but I cannot follow it up with anything good enough right now. It was a good game overall, I have to say, though. 6 3, three 2 I don't know if Eva is a guy or a girl. It's a, it's a female name, but I don't know. I don't know. I am just keep guessing. 4-1. 2-1. 3-1. Two three, three three, six four one, six four two, three two, six three one, two two, six two two, six twenty two, two three. The next turn will decide whether I'm still in this or not. Finish my turn. If I can uh, get a good hit against her, then... Then I'm still in this. With the whip, I can kill the Harvester, unless uh, she dodges my Stormrunner to the side. No, even if she dodges to the side, I... Oh, never mind. I lose. Never mind. Well played. I would need a damage buffing spell right now, otherwise I'm gone. I may be gone even without it. Nah, well played. That was just the removal she needed. 6222. Two, two. Oh, burn is just what I need. And I now can whip this. No, because this guy is on two countdown. I cannot whip him. Shit, okay. It's not exactly what I need. It does help. It does help. Alternatively, Elder Whip, and this guy has four, which is not enough. No, I think Irva will sur survive again. But it's okay. It's, it's okay. It could have been much worse, actually. Oh. Oh fuck! If I burned Irva, this machinated would be exactly the thing to wipe the harvester and the rod eater. Ah, oh, okay. Finish my turn. Oh, oh my god. If I burned Irva, I would wipe the board right now. But I guess I have my Machinated for later, and I will need it. It's one of the most important cards in my deck right now in this matchup. So I can break through the meat shields to the Harvesters and Witch Doctors. Afternoon, Omen of the Undead. I'm playing a super epic game against Eva here. Round 31. And we are still at it. Eva, having a much superior economy, 
and my deck is just better at fighting, so I just barely keep pulling it off. Please don't kill my war- oh god. If she kills this Gravelock, I cannot kill the Doctor. If she doesn't, I can actually kill the Gra- oh, okay. I guess now the Gravelock cannot even attack. Man, the Mist is crushing me here really badly. Um, 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 um. Double Fury, here we go. No, okay. finish my turn. Let's see what kind of removal she can throw at me, because... Actually, no, my good Gravelocks are not about to attack. Languid on the Stormrunner, that was well played. Only two mana, it doesn't cost anything, pretty much, on my... Stor I guess, oh, but now... Ah, but he's still out of range of the Doctor. Man, if he was closer, I'd machinate him against the Doctor, and it would be beautiful. Oh, yes! I can just machinate him. She doesn't, she never see it coming. Okay. Okay, Doctor, you're going down, son. You're going down, and you ain't gonna like it. Awesome. I'm still in this. I'm still in this. <laughs> Don't whip your elders, kids. Good advice right there. <laughs> Elders presented on the screen are paid professionals who do it for the living. Don't try it against your untrained elders at home. It may result in a long-term incarceration. New competition. Guess how many times Joyful has said this is over. <laughs> like twice? I can't believe I'm still in this, honestly. Once my grave locks were wiped, I thought it actually legitimately was over. Oh crap, and he protected him against my elder. Well played. He moved him down. Well played. Um, um. Obviously, I need to sack like this. And then Machinated Elder is the only play. Every time I lose a unit. No, it's just when I lose an army in a uh, momentum-driven deck. It's just that... It seems like Eva has sacrificed a lot of her own, like, army things for, for removal. I don't know. She doesn't establish armies as good as I expected her to. Maybe she's doing misplays in terms of, like, positioning of her doctors. She did lose a lot of doctors and harvesters, sometimes recklessly, I feel. I don't know. She doesn't seem to have enough meat shields in front of them or something. Or maybe I'm just really good with my machination and things to break through. <laughs> he doesn't even play augurs. Oh, that was a bad one. Oh, if he drops a witch right now, that could be so painful. Now, I could kill a middle idol, but I think killing this Cursemonger could be a better idea. Um, I guess I'm gonna burn to kill the idol. Um, six, three, three. Three, four. Let's see if I can pull off some lethal. Machinated. Six, three, two, two. That's lethal. No, it isn't! Because this dispersal costs six, and then I cannot machinate my Uhu. Son of a bitch, okay. Oh no, but I can whip machinated elder, and it is nine. It's ten, actually. Oh, oh my god! This game was ridiculous. Six, four, three. Two, one. Six, three, two. Two, one. Enter. Go. Golf, number one. Enter. 
Good game indeed, holy shit. Finish my turn. Oh. <laughs> It was a nice game, it was. <laughs>